today's feature is on the latest Tarmac Works release. On the right, I'll do a review on the Porsche 911 GT3 and also the Land Rover Defender from the Global 64, which is already in their web store. And on the left is a preview on the Global 64, the Pagani Huayra, and also the Hobby 64 Toyota Hilux, which is going to be launched in their web store tonight, together with other releases for Tarmac Works Owner Club's member and tomorrow for the public. Big thanks to Tarmac Works for sending this for my feature. And now let's take a closer look at the already released Global 64 Land Rover Defender 110 in their web store. Standard blister pack packaging for the Global 64 with very nice car art illustration. A collector box is also included for storage. Details of the Land Rover is decent. They are pretty sharp in my opinion. Plastic insert headlights, love the finishing, it looks really clean cut. Like the details on the hood as well, it's very clean. A roof rack is also included, which is non-removable. Impressed with the realistic wheel sets, they rolls extremely well. And also other accessories and spare wheel, which is non-removable. Most or in fact, all the Global 64 are able to roll with no issues. Decent base and this casting is perfect for Land Rover collectors. And no doubt, looks perfect in your diecast photography. Next, the Porsche 911 GT3R for the Hobby 64 that's deco in Garth livery. Standard collector cards. The details are accurate and very carefully aligned, which is great. Color is the original Garth color, which is very close to the real thing. The liveries are sharp in 1 is to 64 scale. The antenna is also very visible, but please take note it's very fragile. The rear wing is very carefully aligned with the Porsche branded marking. I also really like the details for the rear, which I think is very comprehensive. Overall, this casting is perfect for Porsche collector and also for people who want to expand their golf collection. The Hobby 64 casting never fail to disappoint and will look extremely good in diecast photography. Next, the Global 64, the Pagani Huayra, which is going to be launched tonight at the Tarmac Work web store for members. The Pagani casting always has a very successful release, and this came in the blue colorway. Headlights are painted because it's very small. The whole finishing is in high gloss, the side mirror is in elastic. And just like other Global 64, the wheel set rolls extremely well. Base is pretty decent, although the price is entry level for the Global 64. The overall presentation looks fantastic and also a perfect casting to add into your Pagani collection. Lastly, my favorite and also tonight's highlight at the web store and that's the Toyota Hilux. This Hobby 64 casting looks very presentable. A collector card is also included. The Toyota Hilux looks massive in its respective one is to 64 scale and I think it looks very impressive. The quality is excellent and I love the attention that's been given to this 164 scale casting. Although it's a model car, I'm not very sure it can roll, but I'm very impressed with the wheel set. Not to mention the interior which also have a roll cage. The rear is also very impressive as well with a spare wheels and all the accessories on the bed. Overall, the details looks awesome. Looks even better out of the base, this casting doesn't have any suspension. And I'm really delighted that the wheels are able to roll. Base is pretty comprehensive with painted exhaust. And overall, I'm very happy with the Toyota Hilux being a truck lover. One of the better and more impressive casting I've seen in 2021. The Hilux really have a lot of selling point. All these are already or will be available at the Tarmac Works web store. So remember you can check out the web store if you are a member or you can always check back tomorrow. Stay tuned for more Hot Customs features, and remember to like, share, and sub to this channel. Thanks everyone. Bye.